Everybody's got a problem with raccoons and animals getting into the garbage. You don't want to put your garbage in the garage, so what do you do? Well, today we're going to cover garbage can locks to keep your trash secure from wildlife, including bears. We're going to show you different methods that we're using on different bins. Let's get into it. Now, the first garbage that we're going to talk about is the cylindrical one with the top lid. Here in our province of Ontario, you are not allowed to have a lid that is locked and attached to the garbage. If you do, the garbage people will not take it, so therefore you have to have a solution that you can quickly attach and detach. So with this rental unit that we have here, we have two garbage bins. Before we used to have them on the ground, but now we've created a fence and we purchased these cheap hooks that we put them against the fence and it keeps it off the ground so bugs don't get into it. That's number one. Now to keep the lids closed, it's a very, very cheap solution. We're using these specialty flat bungee cords. You can get these as a value pack, which is what we got, but you can also get single adjustable ones if you're not sure what length you need. We did a double tie around one of the handles and then we stretched it across to the second one and we did two of them. You can do three if you want. Just stretch it over the second handle and you're done. If you want more tension, just go around the handle one more time for more tension. It's lasted one year so far, so that's the solution for these ones. Moving on to the larger bins. For those, you can get something like a lid lock. It's a nylon bungee with ABS plastic and stainless steel screws. You screw one end to the actual garbage itself and then the second one goes on top of the lid and then you have a bungee basically that you just clasp over it and that secures it in place. Now the last option is the strongest option which will definitely keep out bears, squirrels, raccoons, anything. And that consists of a locking mechanism with a metal wire that is not chewable. They're easy to attach and detach through a carabiner. Again, this will require you drilling through your garbage, all the hardware is included, and these will definitely, definitely keep everything out. And those are the three methods that I have used personally, although the easiest, again, are the straps. If you don't have a lot of wildlife, then you can get away with it, otherwise you are definitely going to need to go for the YYST bin strap that's made of the wire. Anyways, thanks for watching, and I hope uh, this was helpful.